Lesson 2 for January 2 to 8, ready for teaching on January 9, Crisis of Leadership, read by Dr. Percy Harold. Sabbath afternoon, January 2. Before we start, let's pray. Our Heavenly Father, we thank you as we open your word almost at the middle at the book of Isaiah. We thank you that this book was written because it tells us about Jesus coming, what Jesus is going to do, and also how we can be involved in that. But today we're studying about the leadership crisis that Judah had. And as we do so, as we open this book of Isaiah, may we find indications there for us in the way that we relate to one another, to our church and to our community. We pray in Jesus' dear name. Amen. Our memory text this week is Isaiah chapter 6 and verse 1. In the year that King Isaiah died, I saw the Lord sitting on a throne, high and lifted up, and the train of his robe filled the temple. Let's read that again, Isaiah chapter 6 and verse 1. In the year that King Isaiah died, I saw the Lord sitting on a throne, high and lifted up, and the train of his robe filled the temple. When asked by one of his disciples about the ingredients of good government, Confucius answered, sufficient food, sufficient weapons, and the confidence of the common people. But, asked the disciple, suppose you had no choice but to dispense with one of those three, which would you forego? Weapons, said Confucius. His disciple persisted, suppose you were then forced to dispense with one of the two that are left, which would you forego? Replied Confucius, food, for from of old hunger has been the lot of all men, but a people that no longer trusts its rulers is lost indeed. And that's edited by Michael P. Green in 1,500 Illustrations for Biblical Preaching, published in Grand Rapids by Baker Books in 1989, page 215. People do indeed want strong, trustworthy leadership. When a soldier was signing up for a second term of duty, the army recruiter asked why he wanted to re-enlist. I tried civilian life, he said, but nobody is in charge out there. This week, we will look at Judah's crisis of leadership and the sad results that followed. Hi there. Thanks for watching this video on the Advent Band Ministries YouTube channel. Please subscribe and click the bell icon to be alerted whenever we upload new videos. So, until we meet him in the clouds, may God continue to bless you. This lesson was read by Dr. Percy Harold for Christian Services for the Blind. It's supported by the Sabbath School Department and Hope Channel Australia and is rebroadcast by Christian Record Services and through podcasts at It Is Written in the United States, Hope Channel Germany and through Apple iTunes and SoundCloud. Remember, God is always faithful.